I'm going to show you right now a way to trigger your brain to experience a little bit of confusion with its proprioceptive nervous system while you're also doing something else that uses this minute error correction mechanism uh, to, to further trigger the neuroplasticity. I'll explain why this mechanism works in a minute evolutionarily, but right now I'm just going to show you how to initiate this proprioceptive pattern interrupt. Okay, It's taking your brain and giving it a little surprise by doing the following. Lean back gently and carefully with your head, I would say about that far back, if you can sort of see where I'm going there. Just as long as you can do it safely, you can sit. And then you can go back to that position in a second. Take both of your fingers like this, turn them like that so that when you put your hands straight down at your side, your pointer fingers are out, you put your head back and successively touch your nose with just the very tip. I mean, only the tip of your finger of each hand successively, bringing each hand all the way down before you bring the next one up. And you just try to be as precise with that tip touch as you can, just barely the tip. And you do that maybe 10, 15 times, be safe, be careful. And then you have done something to your proprioceptive nervous system, made it confused by holding your head in a very weird position that we don't usually do. And at the same time, you've also engaged in something called minute error correction, the same thing we were doing here. One, two, three, four, four, three, two, one. You could also do something like this. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, five, four, three, two, see. You try to get it as good as you can. And in the process of making minor corrections, your brain is saying, I better release those chemicals. Here's an example from archaic history of ours. Why? 